I prayed five times in a day in the past. And I did dua that I want to be the most lovely servant of Allah. But I did one sin. Many times I asked for his forgiveness. Too many times. I felt that he forgave me every time. I promised Allah that I won't do this sin again. But after a month I did it again. And I again asked for his forgiveness. But I think Allah didn't forgive me this time. I cannot avoid the sin. I don't know why. But I really want to be close to Allah. To be his lovely servant. How often can a person avoid a sin? And what should I do that Allah forgive me? The question poses that a person did sin, he asked for forgiveness. And Allah forgive the person and he, was, he could know that Allah forgive him. Then he promised Allah he won't do it again. And then again he did the sin. So what is the solution? As far as forgiveness is concerned, there are five criteria required for forgiveness. For istighfar. For forgiveness, for repentance, there are five criteria. Number one, you should agree that sin is wrong. Agree it is wrong. Number two, stop it immediately. Number three, commit to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you will not do it again. Number four, is that you repent to Allah. And number five, if you can undo it, undo it. For example, if you have robbed something, you can give it back, give it back. Certain things you can't undo, no problem. Then you have to do only the first four things. Number one, agree it is wrong. Number two, stop it. Number three, don't do it again. Number four, repent to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Ask for forgiveness. And inshallah, I'll forgive you. Whatever the sin is, Allah says in the Quran very clearly that however much you sin and you ask forgiveness, Allah will forgive you. There are various say hadith of the Prophet Muhammad that the Prophet said, that you commit sin the full night and in the morning you ask for forgiveness, Allah forgives you. You commit sin the full day. In the night you ask forgiveness from Allah and Allah forgives you. So, for repentance, agree it is wrong, stop it, commit to Allah, you won't do it again. Then repent to Allah and undo if you can. Now, if you commit a sin, you ask for forgiveness, Allah forgives you. Again you commit this, what to do? I feel you should feel remorseful. You should feel it is something wrong. You should not take your sin lightly. Don't take your sin lightly. You ask Allah for help, Allah will help you. If you sin 10 times, ask forgiveness 10 times, Allah will forgive you 10 times. You sin 100 times, ask forgiveness 100 times, Allah will forgive you 100 times. You sin 1000 times, Allah will forgive you 1000. There is no limit. But you can't plan. Okay, I'll sin and I know I'm going to ask for forgiveness. Allah will forgive. This is planning. This Allah knows, it will not help you. But sincerely, if you do something and you're addicted to something and you cannot come off it, sincerely ask for forgiveness, sincerely tell Allah you won't do it again. Maybe, as you said, you did after one month. At least one month you didn't sin. Then after one month you sin, again repent. Do all the criteria really feel bad, maybe then two months you will not do it. Then after two months you have sinned, again ask Allah for forgiveness, again repent, then maybe you will not do it for one year, then maybe after that you stop it completely, you never know. So don't take it lightly. Keep on asking for forgiveness, Allah will forgive you. Even if you do the biggest sin of shirk, you ask for forgiveness, Allah will forgive you. So asking for forgiveness is very important. And you commit to Allah, you won't do it again. Inshallah, Allah will help you. If you happen to do it again, again ask for forgiveness. Allah will even forgive you a million times. But see to it that you depend sincerely for your forgiveness to be accepted. So you said that last time you felt Allah didn't accept your forgiveness because maybe you didn't repent sincerely. If you repent sincerely, Inshallah, I'll forgive you. However many times you do it. And you pray to Allah that you will not do it again. And you pray to Allah to guide you. Inshallah, Allah will guide you and you pray to, and I also pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that may this sin that you're addicted to may be completely gone away from your life and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive all your sin and may you be on the straight path and may you enter Jannah, Inshallah. Hope that answers the question.